Welcome to Tycon Live. I'm Kamal Alwalia, and it's a pleasure to have with us in our studio Sumit Chadha from Sequoia. Welcome, Thank Sumir. you. Pleasure to be here. Thank you, Kamal. So, considering that it's Tycon, Sumir is one of the unique people who has already been investing in India for the last 10 years. So, Sumir, how has the market changed over the last decade? Oh, it's immense changes, Kamal. I would say we've gone through a period during the downturn when nobody wanted to invest in India, where today everybody wants to invest in India. So, it couldn't be more different. But I think um, very exciting times, a lot of markets growing, great time to be an entrepreneur in India. So what kind of uh, areas do you still see as good ones for op entrepreneurs? Yeah, I think uh, wireless is a great opportunity. You know, three years ago we were 25 million subscribers in India. Today it's crossed 160 million and it's adding 7 million a month. So I think anything wireless related is an area we've been funding actively. I think consumer internet, we went from 1 million subscribers in 2000 to 35 million today, scaling very nicely. So those are some of the areas that I think are, are great to start a company in today if you're an entrepreneur. So over the last two, three years, you have a whole bunch of these other VCs also showing up. We have. How has that affected the deal flow or competition? Well, I think it's made it a wonderful, better time to be an entrepreneur, <laughs> a tougher time to be a VC. So <laughs> I think um, the good news is with all these VCs coming from an entrepreneur perspective, um, uh, you know, if you're looking for funding for your plan, the odds of getting funding are so much higher today than just a year or two back. So I think very exciting time for entrepreneurs. For us VCs, it'll be tougher going. <laughs> Absolutely. It's good to be on the other side, right? Absolutely. <laughs> so how has it been uh, regarding the maturity of the entrepreneurs that you saw 10 years ago versus now? Yeah, big shift. I think um, 10 years ago, it was all about offshore services. And that was really, you know, the success of Infosys, Wipro being trying to replicate in many ways. I think today entrepreneurship has broad based across the entire economy. So we're seeing entrepreneurs in all kinds of different sectors. We, uh, for, to give you some examples, we backed Anupa Mittal at Shadi.com last year, or we backed um, uh, a company called Nazara last year that does uh, uh, wireless gaming, to give you some examples of types of mm -hmm. entrepreneurs we're backing. But we're finding with each year the sophistication level, the understanding of entrepreneurship, the understanding of venture capital, and creating value for shareholders is, is, is growing. So that's very positive. Are there a lot more entrepreneurs who are going back from uh, US or Europe? Absolutely, huge trend, huge trend. I think uh, in the last year, we must have funded at least four or five companies where we've taken Silicon Valley entrepreneurs or US entrepreneurs going back to India, starting companies in India. And so we see that as a continued trend we'd like to fund a lot of. So one question I want to ask you, because all VCs say, make sure you pick the VC you want the money from. Sure. But most entrepreneurs aren't choosy. <laughs> yes. So why should an entrepreneur come to Sequoia ah, and you in particular? Sure. Well, in, in the case of India, um, you know, we have been uh, sort of the oldest venture capital firm in India, operating there now on the ground in Bangalore for the last six years. We've invested in 35 companies in India. We've had four IPOs, two trade sales. So I think the most experienced team on the ground in India the last six years. And that really does help because uh, India is still a very tough place to do business. And so having a VC who sort of made every mistake you can make uh, is helpful. Excellent. With that, have a good panel. And thank you for taking the thank time. Thank you. My pleasure. Thanks for your time.